um, I found out I actually had a stomach bug. <gasps> Is this gonna be a fail, fail glow up video? Oh, it's literally gross. John, do you hear that? I'm hearing glow up. Hello, everybody! Welcome back to my channel! Hey, what is up you guys? Guess where I am right now. Dun 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 dun. Korea! So random, you're like, why are you in Korea? I know, I literally just landed in Korea and now I'm here. Last time I was in Korea, I did a glow video and you guys ate it up. And so did I, I loved it. So I'm gonna do another glow up and do it a little bit differently than last time. I'm gonna get my hair done, my nails done, a facial massage, never done that. I'm gonna do a shopping spree, go to different places, and yada 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 yada. Be a K-pop Korean queen. I don't I don't really know. Like there's like different aesthetics in Korea, and I want to explore all of them and see what I like, get what I want, and transform myself to look like super good anyways it is literally 7 a.m. because my sister and I landed in Korea at 5 a.m. and guess what I found out <laughs> I literally found out I forgot my whole entire makeup bag like the whole fucking thing and, her and my skincare and my jewelry I was like oh let me like accessorize and like add jewelry <laughs> Literally forgot them at my house. They're just sitting in front of my vanity. So now you have an excuse to buy makeup and jewelry without feeling guilty. Exactly. I was like, oh, I have to buy so much stuff. Now I have to. We're doing three things today. We're going to go to Olive Young. We're going to get my hair done today. And we're going to get a facial massage. So <laughs> let's get started with today's video. We're heading out now. Evelyn and I completely got ready. Here's the here's a little fit check. Probably wondering like you don't even need a glow up. I really don't. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> have this leather jacket from Motel Rocks. Thingy from Etiquette. This from Urban Outfitters. Motel Rocks. I forgot where this is from. And Adidas. Sombas. Anyways, now we're gonna go to Olive Young. Apparently, it's a six minute walk, which is so convenient. And uh, guys, let's just spend all our money there. I'm so excited to be back at my favorite place. Let's freaking go. <gasps> Korea. I can't believe we're in Korea right now, guys. I'm on spring break, by the way. And as soon as school ended, we flew over here. So this is so weird. Like, literally 24 hours ago, I was in class. And now I'm here. Ah, it's a little chill today. It's a little chill. Wow, it smells like K-dramas. Like, holy shit. Smell it. Take a good whiff. Oh, my God. Oh, I love, like, not New York City air. Oh, I feel like I'm, like, getting a facial from this freaking wind right now what's crazy is that like america you know it's like the melting pot it's like diverse but in korea it's just all korean people i mean like obviously but it's like such a weird concept in america there's every ethnicity isn't that kind of trippy like in korea there's like literally only korean people yeah isn't it crazy when you go to a country they only speak one language i know but then in america everyone looks different but they like speak English, but then here it's like everyone's fucking Korean. It's like the obvious, but if you like think about it, it's kind of like, whoa, why is everyone Korean? <laughs> like, why is like. I feel like we sound really fucking stupid right now. <laughs> so many Korean people. In my school, there's zero Korean people, like zero. I'm, I, there's a population of one, and that's me. So now that I'm here and like everyone's Korean, I'm like, hey. You feel like you here? Yeah, I'm like, hey, boo. I'm one of you. If I speak in an accent, do you think they'll be like, holy shit, this person is so exotic? Not really. Hey guys, we look like tourists. Like, it's really bad. I feel I like hate, I feel I, like only tourists are like I hype over all of you. I'm Korea. Like, I'm Korean, guys. Don't judge. 안녕하세요. 오늘은 Olive Young. I see students. I'm scared. Oh fucking hell! It's a normal. What day is it today? It's a normal Friday for people in Korea. First things first, I need to get all the makeup that I fucking forgot at home. Let's get started with that, shall we? All of Young is like it divided between cool and warm. You guys, I literally found this lipstick on TikTok, and it's literally right in front of me. I'm gonna try out this makeup cushion, and apparently it's the darkest shade. Let's see if it's my shade. Guys, 
$70 worth <laughs> of Olive Young stuff. That was kind of crazy. We yeah, got so crazy. much. Show we them like a little glimpse. Just like, oh my god. Do you hear that? I'm hearing glow up. Weather's so nice. It's so sunny today. I know. What the heck? Just came back from Olive Young. I'll give you guys a haul later. But now we have a reservation at 12 p.m. for a facial massage. Um, I researched for places that like does cool massages not like massages I could get in New York So I hope this place is good. I honestly don't even know really what it is. We are gonna go there right now I'm starting to feel a little delusional right now. It kind of feels like I pulled an all-nighters. I'm getting that vibe right now But yeah, I'm su super excited guys. I'm so excited with for everything I got. We are gonna go to our facial right now Let's go. Let's go we are here in the building and we are going up right now. Look how many stuff are in this building. There's also a restaurant here and it smells so good. A really random building. You would never have guessed that this is, apparently this is a very popular chain of facials. I just know they do a shit ton of lymphatic draining. change into these little PJ set so they can access us I don't know easily that sounds so weird um we got the lymphatic training specialty so like when, we're, when our face is like swollen they'll like snatch it the F up all right we're gonna change so hey <laughs> Guys, this is kind of a cute fit. Like, I kind of want to wear this out. Anyways, now we're gonna get our intense facial started. Let's go. I just got my back massaged and my arms. services and it was only 90 per person and that was like a whole body massage they gave me a back massage but and arm massage shoulder massage neck massage face massage heart stone massage it goes on and on oh my god i fell asleep you fell asleep yeah dude what the heck Oh my god. Guys, this is our face after. My face feels so small and like we have no makeup on so it's kind of crazy. The, my skin texture feels so soft. Yeah, it feels like... Also, I think I had a pimple right here and I think it like disappeared. The last thing on today's agenda is to get a haircut at 7.30 p.m. Right now it's 2 p.m. And we thought it we was, thought like, it was like freaking 10 p.m. We come out of this place and it's still daylight. It's only 1 p.m. you guys. That's We've been crazy. awake since 5 a.m. Guys, we're gonna hallucinate by the end of the day. Yeah, day by the time I'm like getting my hair cut, I'm gonna be like... <laughs> hey, I'm back in my hotel. My sister and I, we're running some errands. It's 7 p.m. now. Now it is time to do my hair. Holy shit! The jet lag is hitting, all right? The jet lag is hitting, but we are pulling through. I'm really excited for my haircut because guys, my hair, I've bleached it so many times and it's dead, it's split ends, and the ends of it are so damaged. I can't wait to cut it. I used to have curtain bangs, but now they're fully grown out as you could tell i'm gonna ask for some layers um yeah there's my hair right now it's literally gross 
And because it's so tangled and long right now, it weighs down my whole head. My head looks just like so flat up here. So we're gonna go get that fixed today. I need to find this place in 15 minutes because um, my appointment's in 15 minutes. So we're gonna go right now. I'm, not, I'm just gonna do a quick montage, you guys. I can't do a full shipping camera out thing. Yeah. So much shorter. I put in layers. I told her to cut in one inch and she I, I, she definitely cut more than that, but it's okay because my hair was so dead it needed that. I look 10 times younger now, but my hair is like cleaned up. Yeah, right now I just look super tired, but I swear tomorrow it's gonna hit. And I'll give you guys an all of young haul tomorrow. So yeah. Hi! I'm back. It's the next day guys. I just had literally the longest day of my life and I'm so tired It's 9 p.m. But I'm gonna test out all the things I got at Olive Young before tomorrow because I can't risk effing up my makeup because I forgot every makeup product back at home So I have to make sure I like the stuff I bought at Olive Young for tomorrow. You know what I mean? So let me give you guys a quick haul of all the things I got at Olive Young that is worth 200 I think $70. My older sister got a few things too. So the first thing she got was this Wake Make Cushion Foundation. In Korea, their shade range is so small that I could barely get anything that's my shade. And I'm not even that dark toned, so what the fuck. And then I got a concealer brush. Better Than Shape Contour Shading thing. Amuse Blush. Jenny House. This is for hair stuff so if you have bald spots sorry guys i'm like so low energy and i have no brain cells left in my brain right now so if i am not making any sense please ignore me i bought socks because i didn't bring any pairs of socks oh my god i'm so excited for this toner pads i've been seeing this all over my for you page but it's so expensive buying it from the states so i got it evelyn got the laneige blurring finishing powder apparently they don't sell this in the u.s so. oh i found one concealer that i'm excited to try i didn't really look into it that much but we'll try it out oh i saw this on tiktok it's the rome and glasting melting bomb safety eyebrow razor eye extender did i get this oh yeah i did get this eyeliner pencil cute eyes maker i think this is for it goes hard. We got another Rome and and glassing bomb lip liner. Okay, let's try everything that I got out. Try it right now. Oh my god. Also, you guys, I got kombucha. If you don't know Koreans, like they're all about health and like skinny, skinny. Na 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 na. Okay, like we get it. You you like to be skinny. In all of young, they sell a bunch of like supplements and kombuchas and like health shit. What is what is the hype in Korea? This is way better than vitamin C. Mmm. Mmm. I also love citrusy stuff. This is bomb. I have to search up what the health benefits of kombucha is. I got the collagen ampule pad pads from MetaHeal. But I'm so excited. Oh. Okay, so they're literally just pads soaked in toners. This is so DIYable, but. I love Korean skincare because they smell so nice. While we wait for this to soak in, I'm gonna try out the lip products. I'm so excited. I didn't know Korea sold lip pencils. There's like a shading tip. Do you see this beige tip? I'm guessing this is for like shading. Definitely for the pout, but it looks like I'm drawing a five o'clock shadow. I have the actual color and I got this like mauve pink color. I also love how you just like roll it. How does it look? I feel like my phone camera is literally fooling me right now. I like this color. It is literally what I usually use. A lot of Korean people rub their lips lip line. So it's like a blurring overlined look. Honestly, I don't get the height because it looks like you just like made out with someone and forgot to like wipe your lips. I like this lip color. Can you guys tell? I feel like I should like start glamming up or something, but I look so ugly right now. Now I have two of the Rome and glassing bombs. I saw it on TikTok and it looks so pretty. What the fuck? It is literally so coral. It smells so good. I look crazy right now. Do you guys get the hype? I really like this texture. I like this color too. What do we think? I feel delusional, that's what I think. 
Bring it down all the way to the neck. Oh my god, I love this tummy tuck. Basically, what do we think about the lips? It's a cute color. Let's try number five. Because apparently, wait, I asked for number four. Why did they give me number five? Erm, um, what the hell? Apparently number four was the popping off one, but I guess I'll try number five. Erm, um, this is literally like Auburn. I really like this color. It literally feels like, like a thick layer of Aquaphor is going on, but it's like lipstick. I like it. I like it. I got this concealer brush. <gasps> Hourglass dupe. Donde esta concealer? So this concealer was actually the darkest shade. Hopefully it literally matches my because then I'll be literally fucked for tomorrow. Broken sweat. Okay. Um, um, um. Okay, let's try. Let's try one thing. Is this gonna be a fail? Fail glow up video? Question mark? I'm gonna cry. I'm literally gonna cry. Please blend out to be my shade. I feel like it's really fucking yellow. Guys, I don't think this is my shade. I also don't think I like this color or concealer. Right, right, okay. Okay, whatever. Whatever. Let's try the blush that I got. This is really cool because it feels like putty and gel texture, but when you start rubbing it onto your hand, to your hand, it's like starts to become powder. So I'm like, hello, what the fuck? No, I'm just kidding, there's just gel. Why, why was I literally fooled at Olive Young last time? Like, it felt like powder. Y'all, hello, fuck, disgusting. Okay, let's try the peachy tone here. Why was I literally fooled? I thought this turned into powder when you <laughs> I don't care, my literally has no pigment. I was robbed. I was robbed. Okay, whatever. We still move, okay? Like, whatever. We are gonna try out the shader, shading thingy. We're gonna try doing nose contour. Loki, this is snatching my nose up. Maybe I'm hallucinating, but gray brown color. But people in Korea use this because it like makes your skin look like it's creating a shadow. Does my nose look snatched? Okay, last thing to try, guys. Don't worry, I'm gonna try perfecting how to use these for tomorrow. I'm just really freaking tired. I haven't been into the hotel this whole day except just now so i'm really tired and it's literally 9 p.m so and i really 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 want to learn how to do eyeliner but it's so hard i like it i like how precise it is i'm just like i just don't know how to do eyeliner how's my eyeliner skills guys i don't know how to do it on hooded eyes anyways i'm gonna go try to perfect this and go to sleep and i'll see you guys when i figure out what to do about my makeup situation this concealer was such a fail what am i wearing and this blush, like, no pigment. Do you guys see it? Because I don't. <laughs> Nada. All right. Have a good sleep, y'all. All right, I'm gonna go, and then I'll hit you guys up later. Hi! It's the next day, and it is a little cloudy outside. It's a little, a little rainy today in Seoul. Today, I'm gonna go get my nails done. My nails are getting a little outgrown, and I remember the last time I got my nails done in Korea, I was like, yes, this is it. This is so cute. So I have a nail appointment for my older sister and I to get our nails done. I have no idea what I want to do right now. I'm just really fucking hungry. Maybe my glow up will start transforming because I'm not I'm not seeing the glow up yet. corner and I still don't have a design to get but I'm just gonna wing it and see what they could do but yeah we're here I think we're in Itaewon right now which is like such a hot place in Korea yeah. Look at how my nails turned out. Holy crap. Oh 
I cannot believe the nails. It was so satisfying seeing how they did my nails. It was so, they were so precise. I was like, I wish I could take you in the store to New York. So good. And they were like being so detailed with everything, like the cuticle. Yeah. Like, I've never gotten my nails done this nicely before. Korea, so guys, good. is freaking The amazing. nails is crazy. I'm glowing up for real, slowly but surely. Tomorrow is a full day of shopping, so I'm going to try to find some cute Korean inspired outfits. And, guys, Korean people, now that I'm here for like the second time again, Korean people are so much more trendier than I thought. Yeah, like so trendy. So trendy. Cool, cool trendy. trendy. Like, hit. Like, you wanna be. Yeah, there. like Soho, but like, I like it. I don't, I don't know how to describe it. And they have so many tiny stores here that it's are so, so cute, cute. Like, not even, not just like cute like oh my god like baby cute it's like, yeah like k-pop oh my god girly pop but like so cool cool cute i'm so excited because tomorrow we're literally just like shopping down like the most trendiest roads of korea so i'll see you guys tomorrow hey guys it's the next day and i am going shopping in korea how freaking exciting is that? I'm going to hit like a bunch of really trendy places in Korea. Last time I literally didn't know what the trendy spots were. So I just went to a random mall and just bought random things. But today I'm hitting a lot of the most trendiest like stores in Korea. So it's going to be so cool. And I just know that Korean clothes are just so much better and trendier and cuter. So I'm ready to upgrade my wardrobe. I'm planning on just buying everything I like. <laughs> So you guys are gonna get a nice cute little haul. Look at how massive this car is. <laughs> like what? Evelyn's not here with me right now. She's at like lunch with her friend. But she's gonna join me later and I will give you guys and her a haul. I thought I overpacked for Korea, but I actually underpacked and forgot so many freaking outfits and all my makeup and all my jewelry. So I'm so upset. I'm really glad I have this day to just shop. The first one I'm going to is Gloney and their clothes look really cute. So I'm really excited to explore and see around. <laughs> Look at these mini skirts. So cute. I'm gonna do a little try on haul. Oh my god, what is this? Shut the F up. Look at these jeans, you guys. I want this whole outfit right now. Cool thing about Korea, it's in every fitting room. They have a face cover so you don't get like makeup on their clothes. Way more girlier than my style. What do we think? What's, what do we think? I wanted a skirt like this. These pants are so cute. I literally just tried on so many things. And now I'm going to go to my next stores. Oh my god, this is a mess. <laughs> Guys, I'm at the store Emus. I'm like the only one here. But they're known for their like bags and hats. It's like so quiet in there. <laughs> Look how cute their things are. So cute. Oh my god, their hats. Wait, I actually love these hats so much. You guys, it's super awkward because I'm like the only one at the store because it just opened but I just picked out this really cute tracksuit it's all pink it's really not my style but I feel like pink is like such a cute color for this upcoming spring and look at this dressing room it is so cute but look it is an all pink outfit I look like a pink marshmallow how cute this tracksuit is so comfortable what the frick even this is so cute green color oh my god you guys know how obsessed i am with red it matches with this outfit oh my god you guys i picked out this little hair scrunchie how cute is this i just bought a bunch of things i'll do a haul later i'm so excited guys this whole street is just so cute and there's just like small stores and boutique stores and pop-up stores and i want to literally spend a whole week here just shopping because i feel like a week isn't even enough for this place because it's just so cute next store i'm at this place called jamie wonder and they're like known to be a really popular bag store in korea like they literally have posters everywhere how cute that is i'm supposed to meet evelyn in this store now and we are going to look at some bags and see if we 
like anything. This is so cute. Look at this cafe. There are so many cute handbags. I like, yeah, I was saying I, I like this one. I've never seen a shape like this. There's so much storage inside. Perfect when you just want to carry around yeah. your wallet. This is a must. Perfect. Yeah. Like imagine for the summer. Oh <laughs> my god. Look how cute this pink bag is, guys. I've been recently getting into pink, and this bag is like perfect for spring. Are you excited for my shopping haul? I'm so excited. Oh my god. I'm gonna steal everything from America. No, you aren't. No, you aren't. No, you aren't. I'm moving out when I come back because now that I have so many good clothes. I'm actually gonna get a lock. Jamie Wonder also has a sister brand, um, Amy Wonder, and it's like a tea company. Their packaging is so cute. And they sell this teddy bear. Look how cute their packaging is. Hi, I'm back from shopping. It's like later at night, and I am ready to give you guys a fat freaking haul, right? Like. Like I've never done a bigger shopping spree than today. All the things I got are so Korean and so cute. I would definitely recommend anyone who goes to Korea to purchase these. But let's start off with the first store I went to, which was Gloney. Oh my god, I'm literally obsessed. I'm literally wearing their tracksuit right now. And it has like this like embroidery vibe and it's so cute. I got this green polo t-shirt. Cropped super cute. Polos are in the spring. I just know it. Oh my god, these I will be wearing for literally the rest of the year. When I have a favorite jean, I swear I'm wearing it every single day. Low rise, baggy jeans, and it's just like the perfect shade of blue. I love this wash. Anyways, yeah, I just know that in every Instagram picture I will be wearing these. Next, this ruffled skirt. Oh my god, I already have an outfit planned for this for tomorrow's photo shoot. You guys will see. Basic tops, they have really cute basics. Like, oh my god. This like sweatpants fit, but this is jean material. Super comfortable, yet gives put together vibes. I got this skort looking thing. It's like this linen material. I feel like it's gonna be a perfect basic for the summer and spring. This gray cardigan, obviously a must have. So cute, such a good basic. I also got this brown off the shoulder long sleeves and they told me because it's like cinch so well if i raise my hand or whatever it won't like come off my shoulders and become like a really weird shirt vibe so this was very flattering on me also this black shirt that was super flattering on me just the perfect like tight black shirt i needed the next store i went to was even when I stepped into the store, I was like, holy shit, everything is so freaking cute. They are known for their hats, and so I picked up a few hats. I literally don't know where the other hat went, and I'm so confused, but I'll put a picture right here. It's this blue denim hat. I also got this pink and beige one. I also got a few accessories from them. I got this plaid scrunchie, a black scrunchie. I got this little green bag, and it's a strap-on. So it literally straps on across my chest. I'm so obsessed. I also got one of their track suits because I loved every color, but I decided to do pink and I'm actually very glad I did. I got their sweatshirt and sweatpants. So cute. And lastly from them, I got this cute little bucket bag. I feel like these bucket bags are so trendy in Korea. So I was like, I have to get one. Lastly, we stopped by Jamie Wonder. And their bags are so cute. Just wait for the haul. So first I got this little bag. It has so much space in it. I already have my stuff in it. Oh my god, I'm actually gonna die. Oh my god. This can also be a crossbody bag. Next, my older sister got, not me, but I'll still show it to you guys. It's this white bag, and this is look at this thing. She's sleek, she's classy. Next, we got this basic black shoulder bag. Such a good going out bag. Oh my god, and this bag literally matches my fit right now. I got this pink little bag. So cute. 
What the frick? And we also got their little wallet. But the best thing about these wallets is that this can be a literal bag. Wrap around your waist or you can make it a little crossbody. I thought it was so cute and so genius. I also got this in white. In a little white. Like, look how cute this would be. Anyways, I think that is all for my haul. Not that's all. I got a fuck ton of which is why I won't be shopping um, for the next 500 years, but that's a lie. I will probably start shopping again in the next like two months. I will see you guys tomorrow because tomorrow it's a big day. I am getting my hair and makeup done tomorrow and it's gonna be like Korean style. So you guys will see me fully Korean styled, vamped up. And tomorrow I decided to do an editorial like photo shoot with the famous photographer. So I will be taking a whole main character moment and taking pictures with this guy who's very well known for taking pictures with celebrities and models in Korea. And uh, yeah, I'll see you guys tomorrow for the photo shoot and the glam. Hello. So here is where my glow up went on a tremendous plateau and downhill. Um, I found out I actually had a stomach bug the entire time I was filming that haul, which is why my energy was so low and I was clutching onto that water bottle. And then that night I threw up the whole night and got two hours of sleep. And I had to rush to the Korean clinic because I was actually dying, <laughs> throwing up at everything I saw. And I actually threw up in the middle of the Korean clinic hallways. And it was really embarrassing and I really went through it, but I still managed to pull myself together and go to this photo shoot. So please enjoy. I feel so freaking dead, but my, I look so good. Maybe it's because I literally yacked everything out of my body. So I'm like, hashtag skinny. Do not recommend. It feels like shit. But I just know if I didn't follow through with this plan, I would regret it so much. I've been mute this whole entire time because I don't have energy to talk. But look at my hair. I need to still do my base. Oh, this is like toner pads, BT dubs. But yeah, I'm super excited. Hashtag glow up in Korea. So like I mentioned that I'm gonna do a little photo shoot, a little editorial in Korea. Like I'm never gonna get this chance ever again. And so I picked out a few outfits. So I'm gonna change. And then we're gonna head out to our first location. I literally just am wearing all the clothes I bought yesterday because I literally brought nothing. So I curated outfits last night and hopefully I get to do three outfits if I'm feeling okay. At least one outfit I would be so happy with. Hey guys! I joined Erica's photo shoot to help her film yeah. the BTS. She is currently sick. We're gonna push through because if not, then I'll regret it. All for the glow up. All for the glow up. Yay. Like low key glow downing. <laughs> like low key. Low key dying. Low key dying. <laughs> low key on a downhill. Yeah, it's hard to incline these days. <laughs> I'm like not really doing much in the background. She is taking pictures. <laughs> I'm like voice of narrating this entire thing. Zara model in the action. Delivered porridge, which is so cool. I just asked for rice and water. I'm craving moonji. Yeah, that's the vibes. Second location. We are at some, I don't even know where, we're, where the F we are, like some sort of kind of a school. There's a lot of children here, little babies.
it for the video. Ah, did you guys enjoy it? Did you, did you guys see like the glow up? Ah. <laughs> so I actually knocked out after that day and slept for the entire day and forgot to film an ending. I know, literally FML. Here are the pictures, the awesome pictures. I look great, I wasn't feeling the best, but the pictures came out so freaking good. Check out the Instagram. Definitely clothing blow up. I don't know about visually, but hope you guys liked today's video. And I'll see you guys for another one in the next week.